Hey guys, welcome to part two of Choose Your Own Adventure Fallout 3. The next uh, poll, check it out. It should be up on the forums by the time this goes up because this is going to take forever to upload. Really quick, going to edit my special. Um, I'll come back to this actually. Done. Uh, tag skills. So the majority of people on the recent poll, well, I guess semi-recent because it's been a while. Uh, sorry about that, by the way. I've tried to record this several times, been crashing left and right uh, on me, but anyway, whatever. But a majority of people wanted me to be, uh, to have explosives, first of all, which I like. I, I really love using mines and grenades. They wanted me to be melee, but I didn't differentiate melee and unarmed. And really, it's two kind of class of weapons, but it's close combat. And I saw someone wanted me to go with Fisto, which I believe is an unarmed weapon. It's a power fist, specifically. So I'm going to go with unarmed, which is still going to put me in uh, close range combat. And I'll, I'll buff up melee after that. And then also, people wanted me to be sneaky, which I know that sounds a bit contrary. I guess I'm just going to have explosions follow. Them. Explosion distraction over there! Now I sneak up on them and hit them in the back of the head with my baseball bat. Uh, it's going to be that sort of action. Anyway, special I should edit. By the way, if you've never played Fallout 3 before, there's bobbleheads out there, which at 9 points you can get it up to 10, and I don't think you can go over 10. So never put anything more than 10. I'm actually going to dump strength out and increase both endurance and my intelligence. I think I'll put endurance at 8. I'm actually going to sync my charisma, because charisma just involves speech skills, which are percentage-based. So if I was really nitpicky, which I'm not, and I really don't care whether I pass the spe uh, speech checks or not. You can um, try to succeed and fail those or just save and reset when I... Point being, you don't need charisma a lot. It's that and bartering and you get tons of cash eventually. Anyway, uh, I do like agility. Luck increases all the skills a little bit. And I am going to buff intelligence. And a lot of people are like, oh, I'm buffing intelligence. Well, it's because I like having lots of skills. It just feels like Christmas when I level up. Um, so, and I know it's there's better things to put it in, but I just like allocating them. It just feels really good. So, going to go with that. Going to exit Vault 101. I'm not an expert at this game by any means. Oh, uh, come on, don't crash. Might have crashed right there, so I might have to restart on. Okay, this time it worked and didn't crash, in theory. <laughs> Bright! Ah, oh, my eyes. Ah, oh, it's like coming off a of alcohol something. That's not even accurate. Alcohol does not make you go blind. Not sure where I got that from. Uh, apparently, my home is just kind of a mine shaft. Ugh, oh, very friendly and inviting. Time to mark out with my trusty baseball bat. And apparently, just walking outside makes me feel awesome and big, huge experience. Do epic music. Love that. See, and I love just tacking those up. Uh, Daddy's boy, definitely not. Gun nut, not really gonna use guns. Lady killer, oh yeah. Uh, little eager is kind of tempting. I'm not a thief. Let's go intense training. And endurance. Okay. I guess this kind of is an experience. Scenic overlook. Wow. I gotta say, it really. I'll do a slow pan for you guys, starting from the edge of this cliff. Ready? <laughs> okay, just kidding. Ah! Attack of the pop ups. Okay, let's try it now. Slow scroll with pop up attack. A little bit. Attach it to a keyboard button, this would probably be smoother. There's the capital. Zoom. And back at the wall. Anyway. I love Fallout 3 for this, actually. The huge, expansive, beautiful landscapes that are just ex just really fun. Ah! Food! Ah! Attack of the pop-ups! Stop it! Stop it! Ah! My character's suddenly getting random knowledge he doesn't know where he got from, and it's just like, I inherently know that I should investigate a radio signal from the wasteland, even though I have no idea what the wasteland is. Ah! Or who the outcasts are, for example. Oh, some water tower. This looks interesting. Doom, do, doom, do, doom. I have the, all the content pack. Actually, someone uh, who... I think it's Aaron's... Got me New Vegas today. For a continuation to this once I... Am finished doing whatever. I'll see. I don't know how many parts I'm going to make this. I guess it's up to you guys. And I can... I'm going to do this first, then switch to New Vegas, though. And I promise I won't mess around with New Vegas too much without you. So, water tower, mm, leading here, and apparently delicious radioactive water. Maybe? There we go. Mm. 
Surely this will have no consequences for the future. It makes me feel warm and fuzzy and refreshed at the same time. Hence my health goes up. And something else, but I'll ignore that. Because, you know, whatever. Okay, so now I'm going to play the... Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm actually diving for the bobblehead before I gain too many levels, because I don't think I get retroactive skill points for higher intelligence. Uh, and again, I love skill points, so I'm actually just making a big dive for that first bobblehead of intelligence to get it up to 10 and then just have that maxed out. But I'm going to play it as though my character is utterly and completely lost, which I don't think is too... F Whoa. Okay. Dead birds are... Okay, it's the birds that are going to scare him away from that, even though that looks really cool. I'm drawn to it. Draw okay. Focus. Fo uh, focus. Okay, focus. It's going to wander off this way. Because the bird's usually circling something not a not a good omen. Kind of scary, in fact. Of course, this path looks like it's warm and inviting! With the dead stuff. And the rusted out things. Wow. The prickly bushes that apparently I walked through without taking any damage. That's cool. Take that bush! You cannot stop me or even slow me down. Now, when I came across this the first time, I gotta say, it looks kind of like a sculpture, doesn't it? Uh, thinking of which, I'm gonna quick save. Because it's important to do so often with this, because a lot of bugs. But it looks almost like an AT-AT to me, like from Star Wars. Or maybe like a, a camel or a crocodile biting down on something. I don't know why I felt like pointing that out. Nice. Ooh, thought I crashed there for a second, but didn't. And the lovely little fields waving, but ooh, caution. It's a good thing I do Danger. Danger from where? From where? Oh, frick. All right, bring it, bug. I'm not scared of you. Yeah. You'd think it would fly away. Ow! Down. Delicious blood fly meat. Mm. A little bit of blood on the ground, probably mine. I think that thing actually bleeds green or something. I guess I can check. Yeah, see, green. Uh, yeah. But anyway, yeah, nice kind of peaceful wind moving the, the whatever this is. It's like a weed. It's kind of serene out here, actually. Relaxing. Another water fountain thing. Take a drink out of it, maybe. Actually, I think I'll avoid it at this stage. Do -do -do. Something aggressive over there. How can a dog be red? I'll just avoid it. Maybe it's one of those untamed dogs. One thing that does annoy me is his owners that get dogs and then they just, like, make them intentionally overly aggressive. You know what I'm talking about? I hate those guys. Not sure if you can... I remember going up to, like, this store and there's this guy and I was like, Oh, what a nice puppy. It was like a really friendly breed. And he's like, I'd rather you not touch this dog. And I'm like, oh, great. So you train him to be, like, a guard dog because that's exactly what dogs need to be is, like, bite prone and whatnot. Jerk. Whatever. Anyway. Tangent. This guy did not drive well. Oh my goodness. That was one terrible accident. Oh, feel bad for the... Ooh, lots of red dots over there. Could be fun. Trash bin. Hey, cigarettes. And a clipboard. I guess. Could write stuff down. Climb in the vent. I guess it's too small. Okay, here, fighting. And shooting. More shooting. Super Duper Mart. That's lovely decor. An explosion in the distance. It's, looks like there's an interesting fight happening here. Ooh. I don't think the good guys won. Oh, frick. This is gonna suck. Ah. Okay, time for a strategic retreat. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, now we play run away. Frick, I kind of want to go this direction too. But they're using my one disadvantage here, range. Daft clever of them. If I swing around this corner too, they'll get a little close where I could bat them. Your time just ran out. Speaking of which... Ha ha! Attack! Ooh, I love when they fight back. Apparently she likes me fighting back. Smack! Nice follow through. Okay, now retreat! Yeah! Oh, sweet. Honorable fighters. All three on one. 
That guy's nude. Okay, let's go for Mr. Nude first. Because why not? Ow! Ah, that was not Mr. Nude. I think I'm like nailed in the head in the meantime. Oh, frick. Ah! Don't like getting shot at simultaneously, though. Eesh. Oh, okay. That was an easy... Oh, bloody bat. Ugh. Ow, ow. Yeah. Okay, that worked. <laughs> ow. Ow. Frick. Okay, let's try to mingle with these guys. Can I at least hurt you? Okay, right arm, that helps. Ouch. Knock down. Yeah. Go baseball bat. Kind of gross little court. Ah ha. No time to talk about stuff happening. Swing. Ow. I think I might. Oh, ooh, wait. Okay. Well, you're not going to live to see it. Ow. I feel like I'm retarded. Ah. Nice. Run right into the bat. Okay, one left. I don't think she's going to give up. Assuming it's a she. Ow. Good thing he's bad aim. Haha, <laughs> reloading, reloading, reloading. Oh, cool hat. Smack! Yes! Ha 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 ha. Smack. You're gonna kick my. Oh! Perfect. Ooh, and hey, gun. I'm not gonna use it, but pick it up. Yeah. He had lots of cool stuff. Baseball bat. Just loot the corpses. I just realized I just killed my first people, like ever. I'm gonna sit here and think about what I did. Ugh, it's terrible. I'm over it. Moving on. Well, I'm over it. My character's still like, oh my gosh. Why is he nude? Does he know that, like, it's dangerous out here? And stuff? Guess not. Go back and drink at that water fountain. First, I'm gonna save though. Be sure I don't end up getting frozen again, losing all that time. Let's see what do we got here? Okay, this is cool. I bet it makes me look awesome too. Just a theory. Let's check that theory out. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay. For a second there, I thought that froze the game again. Did okay though. This is an awesome hat. I really like that hat. I'm still kind of partial towards my baseball cap, so I'm going to keep that on for the moment. But definitely going to utilize that hat later. Okay, baseball bat. Can I repair it? I've got like several baseball bats. Apparently baseball, big pastime for these guys. I don't really need these, but just repair them to reduce weight. Oh, brass knuckles. I don't know who I got that from, but that's what I'm looking for. <laughs> Yeah. Get some aid here. Mmm, delicious rad roach meat. Nom, 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 nom. Apparently this character has a thing for eating bugs. Must be rather tasty. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Okay, there we go. I think you run faster. Kind of like Counter-Strike. It's like your fists are down. All of a sudden you can move so much faster. But when they're out in front of you, you really can't run that fast. Even though it's... Whatever. No one. A gun I would understand, but your fists, really? Nice little barn out there. Alright, I'm not sure why I ate the rad moch meat when I was intending to drink from this fountain, but whatever. Delicious! Mm. Oh, and there's still that dog over there, isn't there? Probably. I can't tack and see him yet. But I know he's out there, watching, sniffing. I really don't want to engage dogs on my live stream or on my uh, commentaries because it's like, yeah, that's right, I just smacked a dog to death on YouTube. Ugh. Edit out those parts. Maybe I can get. Never mind. Yeah. Random bridge over there. Pedestrians are okay. It's awesome. It's, yeah, grotesque. They're so warm and inviting, aren't they? Just like, corpse, hang in here. Come on out. Got plenty of corpses. Free vending machines, apparently. Shopping carts just littering the place. Not very well stacked. Dilapidated vehicles. I guess they're kind of the trendy thing to have out in front of your place of residence. 
Kind of weird, though, because it doesn't look like they have seats. Unless, I guess, the seats were entirely biodegradable or something. I guess the tires were. Everyone's like, take the tires. Well, that's probably what happened. Everyone's like, strip the seats. But at the same time, I don't see any, like, pedals or anything. Maybe they just kind of drove automatically. I'll go with that theory. I like it. Random building. Walk along here. Suddenly it's turned into Bioshock. The Atlas Shrugged statues. We've got another red reticle up. A raider. Not exactly a friendly guy. I just realized in that last fight I did not really... Oh, frick, that's a lot of them. And they have guns, and I don't. Ow. Flee. Hopefully they don't feel like it's necessary to run across the river to shoot at me. With any luck. Yeah. So scary, I'm gonna crap my pants. Fortunately, there's an outhouse right here. So I can sit and do my business. Look awesome all doing it. Not exactly the most private thing with the doors here. Enough of that. Ugh. I think I froze again. Okay, reloading from the uh, outhouse seems like it is a oh, perfectly good thing on Nuka Cola. I wonder why they threw it away. Seems like as good a place as anyway. Anywhere. Nice little tricycle just hanging out in the middle of nowhere, too. Wow, she's totally in view of me on that outhouse, too. Kind of sucks. They just make an awkward conversation. I'll move on. Anchorage War Memorial. That direction. Sounds neat. I think I'll go do that. Cool buildings and whatnot. Nice little minefield. Being super good, I should probably get rid of these mines. Yeah. By diffusing them, not just tripping them, in theory. Frick, that one was like invisible. Those Whoa! Monsters, they're, they're gonna get me. You didn't see the big explosion that just happened, kid? You just are like, big explosion, run right at it. Try to trip the mines. You're like suicidal, jeez. <sighs> what the heck is your problem? Those things, they're gonna get me too. Can't stop now. Well, don't run across the minefield. Calm down. No. Those things. They're right behind me. Leave me alone. You're the one who came running up to me. Stop whining. No, you don't care. The grown-ups never cared. Now they're all dead. Well, fine. You'll just die, too. No, I'm diffusing the mines. That's... Is that a warning? See? I knew it. You don't care. No one ever cares. Well, fine. Go away. See if I care. But those things, they're gonna get you. Okay. Don't touch me. I'm sorry, kid. No! I'm not talking to you anymore. You're a jerk, and I hate you. Oh. I'm sorry. No. They always just say sorry. But then it turns out to be a bunch of lies. How can I ever trust a grown-up again? It's a good question. What's it gonna take? When I was bad, my papa made me apologize three times. Then decided if I was really sorry or not. You wanna talk to me about stuff? Say you're sorry three times, and you better mean it. Uh, uh, okay. That's good. Keep going. I'm sorry. I'm coming. Papa said that's the right thing to do. Uh, good. You did it. Now I'll talk to you. Uh, you're giving me a huge headache, and I've got a bunch of mines to my right, so I guess I'll go... I don't even know why that's an well, option. Really? Thanks a whole lot. My house is the one closest to the huge sign and the old diner. Please, find my papa and make him come back. Sure. Um, I guess. Is there anything no. else? All I got is what's left on my back. Okay. So anywhere you can hide, well, I guess? there is the personal shelter next to the old diner. Papa always said to stay away from it. But I guess it's supposed to be safe. What? I'll head over there and wait inside. Hurry back. That doesn't make any sense. 
Oh, this area that uh, my dad told me to never go near, and he's super wise, said that's safe. What? I'll get back to you. There's a gigantic minefield right here that I need to have a quick save. I'm sure his dad's, like, wherever I'm headed anyway. I think I want to try this from the other angle. Hopefully not set any of them off. Hidden from the mines. Okay, here we go. Alright. Oof. Lag there for a second. Thought I was going to crash. It's a good thing that was off a quick save. Yeah. Try this from the other angle. Oh, that one's like floating. It's probably the most dangerous one. Yeah. Okay. Four more. Huh. Breathe, diggity, breathe. <sighs> Two more. And there's that ninja one that flipped over earlier. Ha! Victory! Minefield cleared. Quick saving. <sighs> Alright, looking for that kid's dad. Who's I don't even know what I, what he looks like. I don't even know where I'm supposed to find that kid again. Anchorage Memorial, which is cool. I guess I'll Go up there. Some weird things crawling over there. Oh, lagged out a little bit again. Hmm. Oh, cool. Hello! No, I can't fix him. Garbage can. Carton. Pretty good cigarettes, and I'm sure this is kind of like prison out here where you can trade cigarettes for money and stuff. Hello! Oh, hey there! Do you need something? Um, you have anything for sale? Take a look. Welcome to God Forsaken Hellhole. Not much to look at, but it's all mine. I like <laughs> you. And I like your hat. Okay. Ooh, frag grenades. Those look nice. I can trade those for my nifty BBs. And BB gun, because I don't really need them now. I'm not going to use a pistol, either. Uh, hmm, keep my original baseball bat. Here's some cigarettes. Uh, pistol, I guess. I'm sure you can use a clipboard. Um, ba -do -ba -do -ba -do. Not using a hunting rifle. Some more cigarettes, which I'm sure you can use. Older, I'm sure you don't care about cancer anymore. It's a cool hat, but I'll give it to you. I don't really need the next to armor, either. Mmm, hard to part with the tunnel snake outfit, but it's kind of weighing me down. I'll just get rid of that, that stuff. That looks good. A pleasure doing business with you. With you too. I guess I'll head out of here. Whoa, sweet memorial. There's no sense in trying to fix this heap of junk. Oh. Damn it. So mean to that robot. And bottle caps. Maybe I'll try to rescue that robot later. Wow, those guys look awesome. Empty. Guess I'll move on. Shabadonk. Shabadonk. Hop. Didn't make too much noise there. Hey, I can fast travel now. That's cool. Dukov's place. Something tells me I don't want to hang out with Dukov. Just a hunch. It's weird. Oh, hey, construction going on over there. <laughs> Let me tell you, this place could use it. Definitively. I realized uh, in that last combat with the raiders, I didn't really give them a sporting chance. I didn't try to, like, offer them peace or anything like that. I should probably, next time I run across... Hey, speak of the devil. Hey, raiders. Maybe if I offer them meat... Oh, looks like they're already in a fight. Ooh. Sizable fight again. Okay, I have meat. If you guys want meat, I could give you that. Meat? Oh, okay, that didn't work. Alright. Yow. Hi. 
Yeah. Oh, hey. Punch! Fists of Fury. And Diggity going to try to dodge. Ow. Ow, ow. Yeah. Ow. Knocked him unconscious, I assume, because it's, you know, my fist. Yes, I know. Oh, frowny face on my head. Now take that pistol out of your possession, because you are just mean. When you wake up, you'll feel better, maybe. Get rid of your ammo, too, because freaking A, you just shoot whoever. Hey, more brass knuckles. I'm gonna take that off your hands. You guys shouldn't have those things. It's just dangerous. Maybe I'll just... Nah, I don't... can't justify stealing from these guys. Just make sure they can't shoot... well, can't open up into that. Just make sure they don't shoot at anybody. Shotgun shells. I don't even think they have a shotgun. Got a lot of alcohol laying around, but I guess that's their prerogative. Just gonna take a nap and maybe talk to them when they get up. Make that a save. And continue on. Looks like they're still down for the count, but I'm sure once they wake up, they will realize the error of their ways. That they should have accepted my offering of meat. And hopefully they won't be shooting at anyone anytime soon. Not very nice people. It's a big bridge. Random guy with a flamethrower. Seems nice enough. Punch in the air, Rocky style. Oh, hey, posters. Felt shelter. Some robot helping up Uncle Sam. Where you be when the Holocaust comes? I don't know. Oh, this looks friendly. Yee. Yeah. It's like a flinging poo at me. Uh, ouch. Eek. You want to dance? Hey, garbage can. I feel no compunction about putting that thing down. Looks like it's got... That might be the thing that's attacking that kid's... village. Oh, there's another one. Ooh, frick. That guy's got a big gun. Yee. Okay, time to escape. Water makes me feel kind of oddly warm. Hopefully I don't realize what happened to me. I think I drowned or something. Yep, yep. I think I lost him. Ah, go this way instead. Oh, frick. Yee. Run! Ah. <sighs> oh, that's a cool complex. I'm gonna quick save again. Cause sheesh. Wish I could take his ammo away, but I don't think I'm gonna get that minigun out of his hands anytime soon. It's kind of dilapidated area. Empty garbage cans. Phones, do they work? Nope. Ooh. A little buggy there. I really could use some upkeep on anything, really. Lovely trees, though. Hanging out here. Gives you hope. It's more of those guys that look like the guys that shot me back there. But maybe if I explain myself this time, they won't shoot at me. I'm gonna have my fists out anyway, so they know I mean business. So hey, I have... Uh, they can't hear me right there. I'll try it from over here. Ah, freaking hey, they're already shooting. Ooh. That also was a minigun. I've had enough of this. Oh. Ow. Smack! Smack again. Yeah. Very meaty. Yeah. 
seem to ow ow. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. No. He'll shoot me if I stop moving. Uh, I see you. Ah. Stop it. Wow, you're screaming forever. Stop shooting me. Stop shooting me. Then you bad aim at point blank range. Ouch. Whew. You are not allowed to have guns. You over here, you either. No guns. That guy up there probably shouldn't have a gun as well. But before I engage him, I think I'm going to engage in a tasty snack to make me more ferocious. Delicious rad roach meat. Oops, got a stim pack. Okay, strategery. Okay, negotiations. Hey! Stop shooting at me. Stop. Stop. Okay, it's not gonna work. Time to make a run for it. Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. Yeah. Whew, it's got bad aim. Yee. This is where having a gun would be really helpful. Not doing this very sneaky like. Oh, and there's another guy over there. Aha. Apparently he wants to engage in melee to melee comment though. Hi. Smack it. Oh, that totally teleported me in front of the gun. Apparently I'm just eating the bullets though, no problem. Yes, yeah, smash is the idea. Ow, 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 ow. Come over here. Ow. That's not what I meant. Ouch. Nail board, cool. Okay, do you still have... Yes. Wait for a reload, maybe. It's gotta take forever to reload that thing. I think he has bad aim. Bad idea. Flying ninja punch! Whiff. Ah. Ow, oh, frick. Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. Really bad idea. Apparently I can absorb bullets like nothing else, though. This guy just has terrible aim. It's also possible. Yeah! Woo! Gosh, this guy's meaty. Ow, 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 ow. <sighs> okay. No minigun for you. You were not prepared to have that. You over here are not looking so hot. I think you were more of the bad guys from back that other area. I think you're already dead, actually. Hey, pool cue. Go ahead and... Help me. Oh, hello. Untie her. Hi. I'm... I'm alive. I can't believe it. I'm alive. Here, I managed to hide this stuff before they tied me up. You take it. Oh, I it's don't need it. It's the best I can it. do to thank you. You go, you go ahead. You'd know best, wouldn't you? Yeah. I have to go. Again. Thank you. You have to go. Again. Okay. Later. Be safe. Don't run into big green things that attack you and stuff. I think I got missiles. What are they doing? Yee. Don't even want to look at that. Yee. Other gross stuff. Make sure when they. Ooh. Grenades. Okay, I guess what I will try to do again is nap, but nap with one, just like a quick one, with one eye open. And then talk to them when they wake up. One hour, maybe. Maybe save at this point too, because you know that was. Wow, these guys just really don't wake up. This glass jaws, yeah, skulls just on that. Actually, after seeing the skulls and the big bags full of bloody human parts, I think I'm just gonna leave these guys alone and let them wake up and do whatever. I don't feel like I can bring myself to killing them while they're asleep, but you know. 
I, I don't think I, I need to tango with them all that much longer. I mean, I've got a minigun off of them. I don't think they can do much harm with just their fists, because apparently they know how to use them. That's right. I got the fists of glory. Ha! <sighs> nice rusted over speed limit sign. But how will I know what speed to go? Big statue of naked guy with the circle. It's interesting. Oh, hey. A, f a cow with two heads. That is weird. Hello, cow with two heads. And spikes coming out of its face. Hello. Ah, fellow student on the path of the wasteland. Welcome to my humble caravan. Please relax, for we are in a place of safety. You realize there's a guy with the a minigun back there, right? The that can only be ensured by an abundance of weaponry. <laughs> wicked and awesome. I like this guy. All of which can be yours. Me, not the character. For the right price. Well, I don't know how the character feels yet. Sure, I'll buy. Please, enjoy my selection of high-quality problem solvers. Ooh, more frag grenades. Schematics. Ooh, spike knuckles. That sounds even better. You have that pistol and the ammo to the pistol. That ammo. I guess you can have the ant meat as well. I'm not going to need the baseball bat anymore because I've got sweet knuckles. Get rid of those. Yay, frag grenades. Don't need the hunting rifles. I have that mini gun, just don't give it to that guy back there. Not really using nail boards or pool cues. Or that helmet, really. I don't really need shotgun shells because I fight honorably with my fists. That sounds good. Another satisfied customer. You bet. Until oh, that guy's really nice. And he got me some sweet spike knuckles. Now I feel awesome. Yeah. Brass knuckles, spike knuckles. Can I repair those? Yeah, even better. Woo! Not sure how that works. Calm down, Bessie. Weird place for a toilet. It's a kind of an odd place for filing cabinets. Whatever. Hey, buddy. What's up? Oh, thank God. Someone new. I need water, please. Water. Uh, I don't think I have any water. Oh, please. If you find some, please. Jeez. I'm just leaving you out here where... That sucks. You guys are kind of jerks in here. Welcome to Rivet City. Please wait while the bridge extends. Also monotone. Please wait while the bridge extends. Cool looking. It's, uh... Whoa! Nice. Gigantic ratchet in the sky extends the bridge. Somehow I don't think that could be operated by one person. I mean, the physics of that don't precisely work. I mean, to... Th up and down, maybe, with the counterweights, but it looks like those gigantic counterweights are just adding gigantic torque weight, making it harder to move this thing. Whatever. I don't question it. Hold it right there. Okay. State your business in Rivet City. You guys are not very friendly. Um, Looking for my dad. And who might your father be? Well, if he lives dad. on this boat, I know. Uh, I don't think you know him. Oh, yeah? And I'm a fairy princess. You keep up this smart-ass attitude, and you're gonna wind up floating face down in the river. I don't think the river's too bad. Uh, is that the kid's dad or my dad? I've lost track. I think my dad's just wandering out someplace. I need to... whatever. All right, all right. You can go on in. If I hear about any trouble, you're gonna wind up in the river. You get me? Still not much of a threat. I, like, was in that river night. I don't know, five minutes ago. I guess the drop would kind of hurt, but... Hey geez. there. Sup? Anyway, I believe I've reached my objective. Or close to it. So, what I will do is, uh, ask... Go check out the next poll. Let me know what you want me to do next. Whether you want me to go get Fisto, which, uh, it's a weird place for that. Um, no U-turn. I guess I can't turn around. No, a motorcycle. 
whatever. Um, but yeah, what, do you want me to get Fisto? Do you want me to get more bobbleheads? Do you want me to go to some other area? Do you want me to continue with the, the quest pot? Whoa, what's up? Hey! I'm looking for troublemakers. Have you seen any? Uh, no. Well, my, my dad, but whatever. Um, it's plain. It's kind of cool. Anyway, uh, yeah, vote what you want me to do next. For people who've played Fallout 3 before, you might have a greater idea. Ooh, am I stalling out? I think I'm stalling out. Fortunately, it auto-saved right as I came in here, so that was a quick load. Um, yeah, let me know what you want me to do. I'll leave it open and then create a poll off of some of the initial suggestions. My first thought, again, is to grab Fisto. My second thought is to grab more explosive ammo, uh, specifically. But here's my prize, the bobblehead of intelligence. Yeah! Woo! So, and again, the world of Fallout 3 and all of the expansions to the original Fallout 3 are open to me. So the sky is the limit. So suggest it, I will do it, and do it with my fists of glory. Yes. Thanks for listening, guys. Look forward to uh, doing part 3.